Okay, so the next mission is somewhere here. Oh. That's that suspicious guy. Hey, Milton. <laughs> Can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Not really. Can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. But I will work hard, and I learn fast. Okay. Give me a hand with this fence. Yep. There's plenty more to do. Pound it in there. We don't want it coming down. Good. Now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. Um, place. Now, lift up the other side. They gotta line up, see? Now the next rail. Okay. You're doing all right. Thank you. That's it. That looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. I hope you've grasped the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but there's more than a day's work here for you. All right. So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. Okay. Just the basics. Don't make him mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton? Angus is your boss's son. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. I know how it feels. Come on! Move! Come on! Oh, shit. Was that guy serious? What did he think he's gonna do if you... Just keep on, Milton. And try and Isn't it that fence that I built? Lasso. Shoot! Shoot! Oh! <laughs> Bad ball! No. How am I gonna calm this thing down? You don't look like you're gonna wind down. <laughs> but I'll try. Whoa there! Whoa there! Easy, easy. Come on, Fender. It ain't so bad. Nice and easy now, boy. There, there. There, there. All better? Okay. <laughs> now, come on, you hunk of chuck. Stop. Stubborn, ain't you? <laughs> Let's go. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. Ugh. How you doing, son? Bit sore, but I'll be okay. 
Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. <laughs> Good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. Uh oh. your mouth boy you will be the first one we kill yeah. leave him alone <laughs> oh careful boys careful yeah. look at this tough guy get out of here how oh, fancy parents get he's paying you to be tough for him huh <laughs> <laughs> no he's paying me to keep the place clean oh. so he had some problems with vermin oh listen to this Real funny. <laughs> no! oh, <God>. <laughs> <laughs> Punch him. Oh, kick his head in, boss. Uh, stop him, Jim. Yeah. When was the last Get time him. He won't hit. He won't hit. I. He won't hit me. Okay. They didn't hire you because you're tough. It's because you're stupid. Well, who's the one beating you now? Get him! Get off that man! Get off! He hit me first. Oh, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in a brawl? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here! Oh, quite a temper you got. Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life, married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> What'd you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy, tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll be back. It kind of looks like Sean. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. Stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. Plenty. We all get caught eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. Now, dear, I, I won't hear any more of it. You won't hear any of it. Not in front of the men. You toad! All right, smile, smile. Do not embarrass me. Mr. Geddes? Hey, I heard we had another incident with the uh, Laramie boys. Yeah, there was an incident. Well, they mean to scare me. Are you scared? A little. I've got a lot invested in this place, and, and not just the land, but, but my family. It's, uh, it's hard to explain. I understand. I'll do my best to keep you safe, sir. I know you will. So how's your family? Uh, just fine. I should probably head back. <laughs> Yeah, I know how it is. <laughs> Had to get on. Okay, I guess. Better? Sure, I'm just tired. I know. Anybody want some more? Hmm. Uh, no, no, I'm thank good. You. <laughs> I miss Mr. Pearson. John Marston, you're such a pig. 
All right, it's getting late. Let's get some rest. Good night, Jack. Good night, Mama. Good night, Jack. Good night, Pa. Oh shit. What was that? What are you what are you doing? My job, Abigail. Lock this door behind me. Don't open it unless you know it's me. Oh shit. They burned the whole place down. What are we doing? Well, I knew something like this would happen. Oh no. Watch it burn. Give up so I can just kill you already. Oh, get him. Ah, that one's gonna hit me. Mr. Tobert, and they've Who's stolen this? my goddamn cattle. You men okay? I think so. Yeah. Jim Milton saved my life. It's Mr. Abel. Yeah, of course, it's Mr. Abel. I can't believe he thinks he can scare me out of here. Then I guess we're getting your cattle back, I guess sir. we are. Can you go too, Tom? Of course, sir. Yeah, uh, in Jim, my PJs. I know you can handle yourself. A little. Go get your guns and head out. Guns? Oh, don't play coy with me, son. We need your help. I don't care what you used to do or what your 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 name is. This is the land of second chances. Understood. Okay. Come in, it's me. What was it? Mr. Getty's cattle was taken. God, I'm sorry to hear that. What are you doing in that thing? Mr. Getty's been real good to us. We I What are you doing? My job, Abigail. My goddamn job. Uh. I'll lead the way. This is gonna be the last we hear out of them. Yeah. What kind of guns do we have? Lancaster repeater, repeating shotgun. Noise. So I have this gun that I used to that I can. Uh, John's cattleman revolver. Okay. What kind of knife is this? Oh, John got some nice weapons. Off your horses here. We'll be better on foot. Okay. If you say so. That's the place up ahead. There's our cows. A couple guards out Arthur's front. Arthur's hat. A couple more around the side, I imagine. Let's get a closer look. Damn Let's that go. beer. The is growing. Yeah, there's plenty of guards. I'm gonna head straight in. Yep, Tom, you head up there and try and give us some cover. Abe, you're gonna try and flank the place and come in from the back. I'll give you a minute or two, then I'm heading in. Yes, sir. Okay. Uh. Coming up to Pronghorn. This one behind me. Oh, not that one. I just want to get get in there with with, with my shotgun. Survive this. Do I have? Okay, let's check this. Where the hell did you learn that? 
Damn it, um. Damn it, I'm gonna die. Um. And. Jim Milton. Jim Milton. Here. You're the fella that said something about my wife. Pissing, shit shoveling, backwoods, sacker, no good. Trash. Trash. That was cute. Get him, John. You know that woman of yours got the look of a woman ain't had a real ride in her life. She's got to make do with some piss poor stinking farmhand. Hey, hey, tell her I'll let her in my sheets. As long as. <laughs> No need to say nothing, sir. Just doing my job. Now, I don't think they'll be back tonight, but how about, Abe, just in case you stay up? Yep. You see anything or hear anything, you fire that rifle three times. Three times. We'll all come running. Will do. Uh, well said. And thank you, Mr. Milton. Truly. Just glad to be of service, sir. <laughs> I understand. You get some rest. Thank you, Mr. Geddes. What? What? <laughs> what choice did I have? Just answer me that. What was I supposed to do? Just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once. That's all I'm saying. Okay, let's do next mission. How you getting on? Surviving. I think. I need to cut that beard. Here. I'll get you some coffee. Only thing I know how to do is. Well, you know. Undertakers like me. Cattle? Not so much. That ain't true. I ain't no rancher. Rustled horses, not raised them. Stole cattle, not birthed them. I was... I was reading the newspaper. I was reading about a... old ranch, Beecher's Hope, down by Blackwater. Was you? Well, Jack read it to me, but... I thought maybe we could raise some money. Bank could lend us the rest. We could be happy, John. Bank we could... loans? I got a 
goddamn price on my head, woman. I know. I know all about that. Every time we about to get somewhere, make something, you go and show the entire world that you ain't Jimmy Milton. Every place we've been, it's been the same. We start doing okay, and then boom. You act like the big man with the gun. I'm tired, John, and I guess I was dreaming a little. At least give me that. Just feels hopeless. Hmm. You're doing better. Milton! Milton, ma'am, Mr. Geddes needs you to head over to Strawberry in the wagon and collect some mail for him at the post office. Sure. I'll take the boy with me. He's getting soft. Lancelot. Come on. <laughs> Lancelot. Jim, if you're heading that way, can you pick up a parcel for me? A dress I ordered. I think it's in your name. My name. I think so. One's in your name and the other's in mine. O only one should have come in by now. How much shopping you done? Oh, yes. A real keen purchaser of goods, me. Look at me. <laughs> okay, Lancelot. We'll make a man out of you yet. Not too much of a man, mine. He's only a boy. Just gonna show him how to drive the wagon a little. We'll save the real exciting realities of adulthood for another day. Come on. Get! You take care now. Of I kind of miss that we can change the clothes. I mean, John is just changing them automatically every day, but... It's nice getting out of the house, huh? I like being in oh. the house, Pa. Be careful on this. I think just about doing things you like, boy. What happened the other night? With those men, did you kill them? I did what I had to do. To protect you. Ma said... It was pride or something? Ma? Was wrong about that. All right, here we are. You all right, son? Sure. Well, cheer up a little. You wait here. I won't be long. Okay. And if you behave. I might let you drive us home. Can't wait. Work's dried up like an old dead frog. Um. Hi, I'm here. To name? M My name? Uh, Jim Milton. Jim Milton. Hmm. <laughs> nope. Nothing here. Maybe try Marston. John Marston. It's a long story. Okay. John Marston. Marston. <laughs> that guy's nope. gonna get Nothing suspicious. Here for that name either. Try Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. John, Abigail go follow him. Roberts. Hmm. Yes, here we are. And also, I'm here to pick up the deliveries for Pronghorn Ranch. David Getty sent me. Pronghorn? Yes, er, uh, oh, er, uh, sign here. We have a bunch of stuff for you. <sighs> and I will help you out. <clears throat> I'll take these. You get the rest of the stuff. Here, let me help you with this, Mr. Marston. Ah, uh, it's, uh... Mostly Milton these days. It's a long story. Whatever you say, Mr. Milton. It's not important. Take care now. Give my regards to Gettys. Thank you very much, mister. Okay. Let's get out of here. Everything okay, Pa? Sure. I hope so, at least. Here. It rains a little. I ain't sure. Come on, son. You'll enjoy it if you try a little harder. Okay. Okay, Pa. Yeah. Going back to Horn, okay? So, wait. We've come all the way out here and we just gonna turn around and go back? That's what we're doing. Turns out, uh, I missed the seclusion of the ranch more than I for. Don't you want to go to the store or the saloon or anywhere? We're going back. Okay, boy? But... I've been sitting in this wagon I don't know how long. But nothing. Keep on driving and walk the road. Yes, sir. Thank you. 
Jesus. I'm your father, okay? I got my reasons, even if I don't care to explain them. Yes, sir. I tell you speed up, speed up. If I say slow down, you slow down, okay? Uh, sure. All right, speed up. Let's get away from there. Okay. Pee up! Who's this? Sorry, sir. Was that a question for me? No. No, keep driving. Um I feel like something's gonna happen. I feel like Jack is gonna drive and John's gonna shoot. Faster, please. Oh shit. Nothing. Just keep driving. I knew it. They're following? Okay. Oh. What? What's wrong? Don't look around. Oh, pa, hey. those men. Are they following us? Just, just stay calm. See that fallen tree? When we get there, stop the wagon, jump down, and hide. Oh, pa. Need to do exactly well, I don't see that fallen one. tree. Here, now. Uh, come on, quick, down. Okay, son, you wait here. You don't move or say nothing until I speak to you. You hear? Yes, sir. Head down. Okay, gentlemen, let's see what you come calling about. What do you boys want with us? Oh, we just want to have a friendly chat. Are you John Marson? You sure look like him. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just here with my son. Did you kill a fella out in Roanoke a few months back? Someone take his back! I'll get him. Oh. Easy. It's okay. You're okay. What? Why? What? It's okay. It's okay. Come on. Keep them eyes closed. Let's go. Come on. Get up. The gun's stuck. Um. Easy now. Oh dear, those men. This is slow. You know how to get there? I told you not to look, boy. Are they dead? I didn't have much of a choice. You saw that. Now compose yourself. You killed them, Paul. Son, I need you to hold it together. Can we get home quicker, please? You were real brave back there. Real brave. Did exactly like I said. Really? Uh-huh. If you hadn't listened, think on a real wrong breath. Go say hi to your mother. What happened? Now, 
It's... No. We got shot at. Shot at? What happened? Well, we got followed, and then... We... Followed by who? Probably someone who knew me. If we didn't get to them particulars, I'm sorry. My son. Our son. I... It was your dress that caused all the problems. It wasn't even a dress. It was a gift for you. 